What's up, YouTube? This is Brewer Station here, and this is going to be, well, yeah, it's going to be a episode 18 of Jujutsu Kaisen Season 2. So, here's the funny thing that uh, came up earlier uh, yesterday. So, apparently, this was supposed to be delayed on Japanese streaming sites, but the way it was just kind of presented at first, people thought the episode was actually going to be pushed back, but nope. Unfortunately, everything is going as scheduled. Just much the chagrin of the, chef, the staff there. I don't like that it's being rushed out like that. I really don't. I'm not a fan of it. I wish they, st they just stopped. I wish they actually did something to um, actually del actually like press a del press like even change up like. Maybe even the days, um, maybe even one, maybe even a shift in the schedule would be nice, but no, they can't do that now. It's whatever, it's, the broadcast is set in stone, they can't do it. Unless if they just can't, they can't, they absolutely cannot, um, present, you know, turn it in on time. Then, or anything tangible on time, then I can get it. It's it sucks with what's happening with Mappa as usual with what's going on in Mappa with Discovery and the and a lot of people suffering because of that. I don't like it you. Um, I'm hearing and maybe this is just maybe this is just a mistranslation on this part or maybe this is something I just kind of kind of heard about on the T on you know. From some from some people on the TL, um, I don't know if it's if everyone else is up to date with it, but apparently there's there's in, insurance bills are supposedly going to get abolished. Now maybe this is a mistranslation on that part, but it's already. But you don't think why 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 does it have to do it? Like insurance should would help you know to get to deal with taxes, I guess, but. With the tax increase, with the stupid ass, you know, tax bill like recently by Kishida, we got two scumbags in Japan just ruining this shit. Like, uh, yeah, I get the work culture in Japan was tough in general for a long, for a very, ever since like a long, long, long time, but it's gotten even more. Like, and I'm just wondering what kind of fucking logic is up with these. Up with the minds of something like Kishida and uh, Oscar. Like, I don't get it. I don't. They, they, they real. They're just literally. They're literally, you know, real life anime villains. I don't like it. I don't like what they're doing to the industry and the country right now. That country over there. I, I pray for. I pray for those who are who are there. I. I, I'm not I'm not too knowledgeable about things, but it's it's not a good look. I I do think there can be some there can be a way to address this along the way, but how much damage will be done until the the you know the proper solution comes? I, 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 it's, it's 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 irritating. Now maybe for many Jap many people who do, do live in Japan, maybe this is not too big a deal, but I'm pretty sure. But I'm, but it is something to keep notice if what I, if this news I'm picking up is true or not, or maybe I'm missing something in context. You know, maybe I haven't read as much as I should to where like I, um, I'm supposed, I may have missed something that says, oh, this is not too big a deal. Uh, but there are supposed to, there are people who want to, who express their, you know, or sometimes, or apparently, set up demonstrations. So I figured this is pretty much a legit concern. But I don't know too much about it. It's just something that's really bothered me already. On top of what's going on with the with the Mappa situation, and I can only hope something comes through. This episode should not even fucking release. I would want. To, I would rather delay this shit. I don't care. I mean, well, Toho did give him a, an ultimatum. Like, oh, you got these mounts to do it. But this Malibu motherfucker decided to pick up Chainsaw Man, Villain Saga, and... Um, I don't know about Villain Saga. There may have been something done 
a, a, quite some time beforehand before he decided he decided oh i'm just gonna cram shit um because and of course villain saga was a different team completely different team um and you know hell's paradise which was ass and then he did this anime it was an anime original uh alistairista movie i i think i heard that the 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 sales weren't good on that one i could have misheard but yeah it, it's just a mess like, it may i mapas are apparently from also what i've heard and maybe this has changed since then but i've heard mapa is in the red Mappa is in the red financially, and I know most people, most studios are are, are pretty much in the red because of how the work, because of how pathetic the currency is, and how the payrolls are, and how most of that shit goes to the production committee. But Ma but for Mappa, who's trying to pick up so much stuff and try even try to fund their own shit, they're still in the big, they're still in the big fucking red, which says a lot i don't know how deep but it's kind of just funny considering how much this this guy wants to push out more quantity over quality and yet he's not he's not getting anything back now with the other studios they probably don't have a choice because the production committee is pushing it on them most of the time which sucks which sucks honestly but it is what it is i i really feel like there should be I really feel like if they want, if they, they this is not sustainable. They, these guys have to literally, these guys do have to literally fucking take a step back, think why is that? Oh, why are we, why are we losing? Why are the production committees losing losing money right now? Uh, yeah, that's true. Um, I don't know, man. I, they literally, I don't know why they haven't thought this through. It's frustrating. Uh, but again, I don't know much. I'm just an observer in the end. I'm just here to just kind of share my thoughts. I'm like, yeah, I'm like, yeah, just you got. I'm pretty sh unless if you guys are just fucking elementary school idiots running this, running running the companies in the country. I don't know how you haven't been able to come to a decent enough, you know, uh, decision solution. Whatever. It's crazy. I don't know what this world's become to, but. I, I will, you know, not, not that I've said, I better stop before I get too pessimistic. But yeah, this is going to be episode 18. And episode 16 and 17 were some of the best anime episodes I've ever seen, in recent years at least. In all time, I don't, I'm not entirely sure. Uh, I would guess so. I mean, for a TV episode, it looked like a movie. It did look like you could say is legitimately a movie, which says a lot. But I think this is the this will be the last high in terms of the visual quality for Jujutsu Kaisen now. I don't know what else to I don't know how it's gonna go here, with, down here. I can just only hope it's presentable enough, uh, and especially considering a certain character that I. Uh, I know it's not, he's not gonna, his, his days are numbered. Or he even, no, not even just days. His time is limited at the moment. You know who I'm talking about. Anyways, let's get to the episode after my long ass ramble for nearly nine minutes. So yeah, let's uh, get to it. Oh, I still have that one. Um, hopefully I didn't get the shitty subs too. But yeah. Oh shit. Oh shit. I hate that I said it like that. All right, um, my bad. All right, so episode 18 is three, two, one, let's jam. Sakuna. Oh yeah, usually now after this he's really gonna get executed. Oh Chupe. A lot of shit going through his head right now. Uh 
Hearing all those voices in there, Megami, Jojo, Nobara, Goso now. They're using, they're doing this, this, this sort of thing to limit the amount of, you know. Cut corners here. Right and wrong. Oh yeah, Mahito is yeah, Mahito is still out in the loop. Is out and about. Nami and Go and Jogo are both dead. Just a lot of thing. It's gonna be much of a twist. Like <laughs> we and the the crazy thing we have, we don't even know too much about Eugene's own backstory yet. What was that? That's none of me. Wonder if he's gonna see ghetto, ghetto on the other side when all is said and done. I don't see him living. Like he's in bad. Like unless if someone got that, got one hell of, unless if revert, you know, reverse curse energy got the one hell of technique. There's no way you can fix whatever, whatever the fuck happened to him there. Oh, pff, Mahito. Of course he's looking. What have you been doing all that all that time there? Probably just been waiting shit out. He's like, oh fuck, I'm no I'm not in the, I'm not at the beach. I'm in front of this shit. I can't die in peace. He's just been, I've been working, working, working so hard, and then she's like, man, I want to go, I just want to just take it easy, but looks like I might not even get that chance anymore. Just 
Been tired of this overtime now. Wow, that's nice fucking scene directing here. Does he, can you he even move that arm anymore? This is just, this is very, this is just like thematically beautiful, but it's also fucking depressing because the, the contrast is just crazy. Oh man, Yuji's gonna be, this, this, by the time this, by the time this episode ends, Yuji's just gonna be on a, on a new level of depression. Whoever's playing the piano, whoever's playing the piano, better be. We gotta get a fucking cruise, you know, cruise vacation. Ah, fuck. It's too late. It was fucking spying her. It's too late, you got the hand on. Oh, he's still thinking of his boy. Oh, it's, he knows it's already over. And the oh, you got as I all say something to that to, to, to that young man right over there. Leave everything to you.
You, you piece of shit. Oh, wow. Wow. Fucking asshole, man. What about that fucking dude? That, that fucking big old thing from the... Of what it was, never mind. Jesus Christ. Oh, we got the scar. This is fun. <laughs> He's using that's Junpei's head that he was re that he was replicating. What a what a fucking dick, man. Oh, oh damn! You took the words right out of my mouth, man. He always been. He always yapping and rapping. That's why he's such a fucking problem. So, sir. Yep. It's the best you can do at this point. Purple. Always pur- Oh damn, there's gonna be no- Ooh! Nice. Oh, dang! Ay, ay, ay. The fucking blades? Nah, that's just. No, it just reminds me of some of those games where you have to go through tight rocks. You gotta fucking remember how to dodge those sh that shit. So up here, there's no reset. You gotta just. You gotta just really be on your toes. Damn, there's gonna be no more room. No, I'll punch his way out of it. Yep. Oh, <laughs> that's that's so sick though. Yeah, I know Mahjo's just gonna continue to be a problem here. <laughs> I know I don't I know Eugene's not gonna just it is going to be one pain in the ass to deal with for at least a couple of episodes. 
Yeah, the g He has a fucking... He has a fucking heavy machine. You remind me of that one... What was that one character? That... That could turn this fucking shit into a fucking machine. I think, oh yeah, it was Vash. Go back at him. Yeah, Scyther? Oh, there's a punch in the hole. Prepare to punch it. Dude, oh no, not there, the elevate. Oh, this fucking tame piece of shit. Ew, nigga! Man! Oh shit, my bad. I cussed. <laughs> I'm sorry. The smear's going fucking crazy with. Oh hell no! Nah. That's like the that's like that one. That's like the fucking Daniel Tate saw man, man. Oof. Oh yeah, he punched and he just jumped over. Oh, he knew, he know usually can do a lot of damage to him if he's not careful. That's why he's playing with these dirty tricks. What are you doing here, man? It probably already got transfigured. Yep. Yep, they're already trying to say good. Wow. He just instantly turned that dude into a sword. Oh, that was before. Oh, so that's. Oh, so that's why he got. He was able to get all those people, all those transfigured humans. Oh no, don't tell me. I hate this. I sometimes hate this fucking humor they just randomly throw at us. I miss fire. I miss hot headed Jogo. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie, man. I. Oh no. They're gonna make up for that for that embarrassment from before. 
yeah. You got the fucking you got the you got the fucking Midas touch, but instead of gold, it turns you to fucking slot, fucking g giggly slime. Nah. Oh, we use that as a version. Ooh. That's not... There's, there's no way that's enough. Met Eugene. Oh man, no, this is not good. Not good, both in that it ended so abruptly and what's gonna happen next. Fuck, fuck Mahi, man. Uh, like, yeah, he's pretty fun. He's fun, like, I'm not, I don't, it's not like, I like his, I like, I like that he's an, I like that he's a jerk, but still, fuck him, man. <laughs> He's such an asshole, and he and he and he, and he, and he, and he embraces that shit. Like he don't care. He just wants to fuck with everyone just for fun, and just because that sense of curiosity, because the way he was he was created. I mean, it it's it's still like it's it's, it's still a piece of shit. But at least you can get behind why he's like this, <laughs> and why he's willing to tag along and just. This is just considering Eugene's ideals, what he was been taught, and again, I we still don't have much context of his backstory yet, at least anime-wise. Even with the tidbits we've gotten so far, even with the manga, from what I heard, I don't think there's enough. Unless, oh, well, it may have to do with his mom. What what happened with his mom or dad? But I I don't think I remember much from how that went down. But yeah. I have to give credit to that voice actor. He makes him so he makes his annoyance like uh, exponential. <laughs> that was a good episode, but of course you can see where the shortcuts with in terms of the production was. But it's still but Gonzo made it. But the director, but the director, per, from what I heard, personally handled this episode. The main director handled it himself. So that's why it worked out to where in you know as the usual placements for where there's shortcuts where they can't follow through he switches up camera perspectives to make it a more dynamic switching back and forth it can it can be annoying for many people and if you're somehow complaining about it now i don't know why you're still here he, he tends to you i like it but I really like it, but it's like, it is a hit and miss, especially in situations where you feel like there should be allowed a lot more flow with the bat, with certain parts of the battle. But I don't, I'm not, a, but I don't, I don't hate it. I, I, I completely, I can complete, I can completely buy in. I've completely bought into it the first time. I will continue to go on here, but I will note where it does kind of not hit as well as I would wish it would. But it carried the scene. But it carried the scene for sure. Again, you can see where the shortcuts are. It's a. It's still a miracle. This even is supposed to cut. This is not even supposed to come out. This is not even supposed to be released. They. They. They bum asses and they bum ass higher ups and mama should have should have delayed that shit till next till till next season or the end of next season. Maybe like till March. But nope, they're not gonna do it. They get told the the committee gave them a, a a deadline and they have to stick with it. And this dumbass and their dumbass president decided to pick pick up two more shows, like I mentioned before earlier before the reaction. <laughs> it's still terrible. Uh, again, Mahito's a piece of shit though. <laughs> let's let's get that straight. Not, I'm not saying it as a detriment to the detriment to the series writing wise, but I like it that he is an asshole. Because it has to drive, 
it has to drive you to that sense of like I, the, the, there is a mid point where i do feel like the humor with it was with uh jogo and daigon was a little too was a little too hey, I, i'm not fond of it but again i'm, I'm not i don't I don't, I'm not. I don't. I'm not gonna hold too much against it. It's kind of just like, okay, what the hell was that? Um, sorry, this is not. Um, so yeah, I'm not. I like it. Um, Eugene, like, mine was doing all he can to just annoy the shit out of Eugene. And if I, okay, if I miss anything in particular, um, I do. I like. E that the way that Eugene is at least like he, he has to pull himself together. He still is, but you can just tell like if Nova when once Nova kicks the dust, I'm pretty sure that's gonna, ha and you'd have to know that day is going to happen. Um, he's gonna be really broken. I think like if he's not this, if he wasn't so like banged up physically and mentally before the account, but before the reunion. He probably might have. I I think he would be. He was. He would give. He would be able to handle my. You know, be able to go against my one on one. I'm like sure. Yeah, he went two on. Like him and not him and Nami like literally two v two v one bodied him. Although Sukuna just kind of into <laughs> just kind of you know checked in just like back then. But Sukuna's not gonna help this time. Nope, <laughs> he don't care. He don't care for Eugene. He only care the most he would care about Eugene is just keep him around until he gets a, he gets a better vessel. That's that that's what it is. And I'm pretty sure that that new vessel and you have to think that new vessel is Megami. There's no way else you can think about. It. That's why he literally st said that. He's using Eugene at this point because he got that fucking raw physical strength, which is helpful, but he wants more of something like with what Megami has. The Ito is not even is nowhere near the strongest in his in, in his in his damn world, which is uh, refreshing. But you also have to know that there is times like he's where well, I liked where he's trying to struggle against adversity, and nothing is gonna come so clean for him. He's he's gonna be just lose. It, it hurts me when like season one was just him so having. It seems so fun. Well, except for the Junpei one, that that hurt. But you know, and having to him being more sentimental about trying to put down former humans, that that also sucks. And you know, showing you know empathy for Choso's two brothers, I think it was Chisu and the other guy that looked like a Jojo character. Like he he did he was just like oh sorry, and that's what he's really into Choso. And I get where he's trying to at least be like oh I'm. I'm not, I, I didn't view, I didn't want to, I didn't, I wasn't having pleasure in putting him down or anything. I actually did feel, I actually do feel, you know, some ways about it. And Chozo didn't take it lightly, of course, but the reason why he didn't, he didn't finish off Yuji was because he hurt, felt, what I'm pretty sure, is that maybe his brother's, his pat, late brother's memories or blood passing through Yuji. I, 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 it could be his blood, but it could be his memory. I, 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 I don't, I don't think the anime made it that. I don't think the anime, or I don't even think the manga, made it as clear as it should. I would have to say blood, though. I mean, I don't, unless if there's some fucking memory jujutsu or some shit, whatever. The fight with Yuji versus Mahito was pretty dynamic, limited but like dynamic. I have no. I don't, I'm not, I'm, there's no complaints of how that went down. Like, the, of course there are, you know, places where, you know, the backgrounds, like, you know, it's really rough. A lot of times where they just stood too still on certain scenes. But again, I, again, I'm not going to hold too much against it. They, whatever, whoever, the, the animators who are on this one, I, I will give all the credit because they managed to get something in time. Thankfully. I mean, I would not be surprised if this episode was handed in, handed in just the other day.
Like maybe even they got okay, so they got like preview images, but they're not quite finished, and they will just hand it in a few hours, just a few hours before broadcast. That would be, that is very believable. <laughs> Cause I think something sim, I'm pretty sure something. If I remember correctly, something something happened to this with the Wonder Egg priority, except it was even closer. Apparently, it was within. I think it was within the hour with one Egg priority, which is not good. And even, and you also have to notice with those that that shit was when when those were happening. That shit was rough as well. But yeah, I, Nova is good. I, the the play for them. I don't think I really need to go into it. It was again. It was limited, but I like how it went back and forth with him in the dream scene in the beach, where he just wanted to. The dude's been working overtime for like God knows how long. Ever since no, ever since his his boy Habara bit the dust, and like he's still like even back then he was he wasn't that you know he wasn't so jo He's not. Jo I don't I don't think he's he's gonna force himself. But he's just like damn. I've been just working this hard all this time. That's like damn. I'm fucking tired. And in a way, he found death as a sort of a, his his demise as a sort of relief. Knowing that at least someone younger, much younger than him, like either Dory, can at least pick up, you know, can, you know, take his place, you know, make up for, make, you know, and try to take, you know, continue the battle for him after he that after he passes on. It's it's really ne 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 messed up well how he went out. It wasn't to where well. It wasn't something that induced tears, but and I know a lot. But although I'm pretty sure a lot of really strong Nanami fans would would really just be very up in arms about this one. Ma again, again, Mahito. They did a good job making Mahito being the most the most despicable fucking character in the entire in the entire series for sure. Like no one else is. If anyone somehow despises Sakuna more. I need to question your fucking insan- your fucking sanity. That, that- that doesn't make sense. At least Sakuna got- or he got swag. And he know- and he know what he about. But Mahito is just a- it's like a- it's like a fucking child. An annoying- an annoying child, he likes to bully everyone- bully anyone he think that he- that he- who, who isn't as strong. Uh... If he wasn't for if it wasn't for Go if it wasn't for the shit with Go Gojo getting sealed, he would have got he would have ne never even got to meet got to got to come into contact with Nanami to begin with. Because Gojo like as troublesome as he as Gojo I mean noted he was he would have I'm pretty sure he would have been able to put down Mahito. I personally think. But again, things once it got sealed, things just changed for the worst. And I mean, I'm not saying the villain, I'm, but the the antagonist side is they have their share of casualties too. Let's get that out of the way. Not just not as much as our as our good guys are. Well, I mean, I think I mean I could be missing something something on that, but yeah, it's. Oof. It isn't a Sakuga Fest, but it's still quite an episode. I'm not. It's not something again. I'm gonna ram about like, oh, this particular cut or whatnot. It's just one of those. Uh, it's just one of those episodes that was great, but it doesn't have like. It's not. It's not absolutely blasting with um with with, with Sakuga quality, whatever you want to call it. But yeah, it's gonna get worse for you for you, Jing. Nobody is not. No, I, I, I'm pretty sure Nova is not going to be scripted to, to, to be, to live this out the way things are. <laughs> the way, because uh, Mahito was like, oh, if I put her down, it's going to fuck up y Yuji even more. I just, it also just realized, it also just occurs to me, like, like, yeah, like how, if anyone's wondering, oh yeah, how is Mahito there? The thing is, with the thing is, he split in two. This fucking G, like this fucking G, is literally, he's literally like the uh, what was that one? What was that one animal? Like I guess the, 
I think it was a flat. I think it was a flat one. They, they, there's some, some of them like, they don't, they don't re, they don't actually, like, reproduce normally. They split. They just split. They just clone. They literally clone themselves. That's what Mario kind of does, but it's more like, not like Kage, not, not, not like Kage Bushin Jutsu. No, no, not, not that one. But it's more. Like he literally split in two. There are two consciences work. Separate conscious at the time, but they're the same guy. I mean, that's how I that's how I think it was working. I could be wrong, but yeah, it's it's just gonna get it's just gonna get even more <laughs> worse. I hope not, not. I hope it's not. I hope when I say that, it's not the visual quality though. I mean, I I know this this show this episode wasn't supposed to be really really prioritized in terms of like overall compared to the last two but it's still i just hope it still needs to look 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 really good in the end again i'm glad this is presentable but you you, you can it unless if you're just a casual viewer you will notice i mean even if you're casual you might know you'll probably still notice those notice where things are a little feel a little jank or quite jank here and there. Not that it completely ruins the episode. The episode, don't get, don't get me wrong though. But just like, yeah, you can tell where there's cra there's obvious there's obvious big cracks in the production. With the with, or you could just say the production is kind of dead. <laughs> I mean, it's still kind of okay. I can't say it's dead. Like if I say it's dead, then the whole thing just then the whole thing just flat out will have to be. This flout is borderline cancelled or delayed indefinitely. That's when you say the production crashed or died. That's the only way I can say it. Anyways, that'll do it though otherwise. Smash like button, let me know what you think in the comments below. Follow me on Twitter, support the YouTube channel, join Discord server, share the video around, the good stuff. But it's gonna do it for this ed edition of Jujutsu Kaisen. The real session signing off. See you next time. Take care, stay safe, y'all, and have a great day. Peace.